Okay, there you go guys. In this video, I will demonstrate how to apply 10 different beautiful background in Close 3D. Okay, so to do so, first I'm here in Close Workspace and I will go to this library tab and double click on this stage folder here. Next, I'm going to hover the mouse over this stage and I'm going to double click on it. By default, I have open and the objects I have seen and prop render and property after that i'm going to click on ok to confirm and that is so this is perfect background for number one and um, let me expand this to only 3d window so we get to see the entire view better all right we can rotate this however we like and then we can capture it and save it for the future you can simply go to capture as normal and then there you have your first amazing background in Close 3D. Next, I'm going to demonstrate how to change this background to the next one. Simply come over here, double click on that background right there. And by default, we have open, we have scene and prop, rendering, property, and so on. After that, I'm going to click on OK to confirm. And there it is. This is a second background in Close 3D. In this case, I'm going to continue to number three. Simply come over here under this asset tab and double click on here. Once again, simply click on OK to confirm. So right now we have here is number three. Next, let's select another background here. So I'm going to double click on the next background. Once again, click on OK here. So it depends on your design, which background you like to have. However, though, when you decide that you like to have this background, simply go into file and then come down here to snapshot and then go to 3D window. And you can, let's say here, this is my favorite background. And then I'm going to navigate to my folder and let's name it background and then click on create here. After that, I'm going to click on save and by default, I have this image. So instead of select all the images, I'm going to come over here and then select maybe two. And then I'm going to move this a little bit and I'm going to select right here. Click on the camera icon to capture that angle that I want. Okay. So next I'm going to kind of rotate her a little and I want to this kind of different angle. For example, I want this angle and let's just pan it up a little and zoom it in. Okay, so the angle right there looks pretty good. I'm going to click on that camera icon right there to capture her with a different angle. Okay, and I can also zoom out, zoom in how you like. So for this example, I'm going to simply double check on the option here. I want transparent background, save separate images, which is perfect. Be sure this resolution is 300 dpi, okay? Because we want that high resolution and portrait is perfect. After that, I'm going to click on save. All right, there you go. So now we save this perfect background. Next, we're gonna change to the next background here. Simply double click and then click on okay to confirm. And now we have more background to play with, with a different angle. It's actually pretty awesome, guys. And this is all free, came with Clo. I'm going to scroll down here and then continue changing the background. Click on OK here. And there it is. So keep going. Let's say for the example, if you want to present your swimming suit, this is like a perfect scene background for your avatar. So we have total of 10 background that you can play with. Right now I'm right here at this pool scene. So if I hover the mouse over that background, I will see the expand of that background. For example, this is pool scene. Next, I'm going to select this scene right here. So double click on it. And then once again, leave everything as is and then click on OK. So this is another beautiful scene. So it depends on your garment, okay? Your design. The emotional mode for your design is important. You want the environment associated with your garment that you want to present to your customer at this point. So next, let's move on to the next scene here. I'm going to double click right here and then simply click on OK. Okay, let's say this scene, I also like that scene as well. Simply go to file and then snapshot that scene. 
And next, I'm going to click on right here. This is going to be a last scene here. So double click on it and then click on OK to load the scene. And there it is. All the scene here came with Clo. So there you have a design sir. I hope you guys found this video helpful. And remember to give it a thumbs up and follow me on Encoder Fashion for more awesome videos like this. Thanks so much for watching, guys.